Hey guys, this is Sarah with Sarah Lee Crochet and Fabrics, and I am just going to show you guys my fabric haul all for the last few days. These bags that you are seeing here, um, two of them are scrap fabric hauls um, that I got from a seller on TikTok. So for the first fabric, she sells African fabric, African Ankara, and just show you guys. Thank you so much. That is her name is well, the business name is Zesty Couture, and um, you can find her on TikTok or. Um, yeah, on TikTok, and then there is her email, zestycouture at gmail, and you can reach her there. Anywho, so I ordered a stretch, two-way stretch fabric from her, and stretch that way. I just got a yard because I wanted to try it out, so I believe this was $12 maybe. So yeah, I really like the Vibrant. I love Ankara fabric, I do a lot with it, um, but this is probably the second stretch fabric I've owned, so I just wanted to try it out. Um, it's very durable, it's a very strong fabric. This, I mean, honestly, you can... fabric so I got one yard of that I already made a dress out of this fabric um, but I ran out I have what six yards and the dress took just about six yards so um, I'm wearing it probably to a African wedding and I needed a head wrap so I ordered one more yard of it I believe it was eight dollars for the single yard so I got that and then let me just show you well, I'll show you all of the scrap I got it's a lot this is the first bag so I have an ongoing scrap I won't call it a blanket, but it's pretty much just me putting all of my scrap yarn, especially the Ankara fabric. I have two scrap blankets, one is specifically um, for Ankara African fabric. So yeah, so that's what I have put together. So this is a piece. It's pretty large. I would say it's about 24 inches by 12 in the largest part. And then same one here. I would say this is about a 10 by 10. And then 10 by 10 as well. She does a lot of sewing online, so um, of special orders and stuff like that. So you can sometimes see what fabric will probably come up in the um, scrap. So these two pieces, this is about a seven by five. This is probably about a 12 by five. And yeah, these are two seven by fives. This is just kind of a random cut. But I love these bags because of course I create my own scrap, but it's of you know my fabric. So when I order these, you're getting fabrics that you know you don't have in stock and you don't want to you don't have to pay for the yardage. This is a pretty long fabric. This is the front of it actually. And let me just do an estimate. Fold it over here. This will probably be a five foot by eight inches. So that's a pretty good size. I actually own this fabric, but I haven't cut mines yet, and I wanted to have some scrap in it. So I saw it in the scrap bundle so I did get it this is um, about a 24 by in the highest point a 24 by 13 something like that some of them are oddly shaped which is not a problem this one is probably about a 12 13 by 5 so these are really substantial pieces this one is about a 15 by 10 so really big pieces guys yeah that's about a about an 18 by 5 and this one is probably about a 14 by 12. Um, I never mind these because they're super easy to get out with a iron and a paper towel. So just another little one to that. This is a really long one again. I think this is about, this is probably about a four foot by eight. And then this one is also a substantial piece. This one's probably about a three feet by 10. So I'm really happy about that because I wanted some of the lion fabric, but I didn't want to order it. So just some more random pieces. I'm not going to measure all that for you guys here but I will be using every bit one of my blankets like I said is all Ankara and then I have a little blanket oops which is also it's just a mixture but it really focuses on smaller pieces so anything left over that I add to the bigger blanket any smaller pieces I then add it to the smaller blanket because it's just tinier pieces so yeah that's everything in the first one and then the second one here so here is one of the fabrics. This is one of nine by five, something like that. I actually really like this fabric. Really, really cute. It's a big piece too. It is, and there's the full of it. This is probably about a 24 by 12. And this is also a sizable piece. This is probably a 16 by 16. And I'm not going to go because I got quite a bit of these. But there's a lot of it, guys. Lots and lots of this one fabric, which I absolutely love. Okay, here's another piece of another one. This is probably a 12 by 10. And then just more pieces of this particular orange, burnt orange fabric. 
really substantial piece here. Find something different. Got a lot of that fabric, so I'm very happy. And then also this pretty blue fabric that I'm happy about because I have nothing like this in my stash. This is probably about a 30 inch by 16. So yeah, really pretty print there. So I'm really happy about that. More pieces of this fabric. And then more random pieces of this one, which is really cute blue. And I love it. Go. Put that aside here. And then another one I don't have. This is what about a 16 by 10 maybe. Really cute teal color. I don't have much purple in my stash, so I was happy to see this. This is about a 24 by 16. So it's a pretty substantial piece of fabric. And then we already seen a bunch of these. And then a fabric I did get, I saw at Fab um, Hobby Lobby. I may go back because I was just in a rush. But this is a folk, faux leather fabric. And this is my first time seeing it at Hobby Lobby. And trust me, I know that store very well. <laughs> um, they also had a beautiful green. It was almost like an army green. Really beautiful. It was a little thicker. Substantial of a fabric. And then they had burgundy um, was the other color. And then they had black. And they had some stretch to it um, both ways. So that's good. And yeah, I'm not sure what I'm going to make with it, but I don't have anything like this in my stash, so I had to pick it up. But yeah, I will include a picture, guys, of the one blanket um, that I've been making with my Ankara um, scrap so far, so you guys can check it out. It's pretty big right now, but I'll um, take a picture of it. I just keep adding to it. Um, it's pretty much I'm making, you know, my own fabric. I'm not going to use it for a blanket. I'm just going to keep adding on to it, and then one day I'm going to make, like, something with just all these beautiful fabric in one outfit. Anyways, guys, I just wanted to check in, show you guys what I bought, and everyone have a great day.